Isn't that obvious? I'm plenty friendly. I said, I'm plenty friendly. Don't know. Sigma. No, you haven't. I don't have any idea who you are. But... How the hell am I supposed to know? I just know it, okay? Shut up! Just back off, Grandpa! Look, I just don't know, alright? It's just kind of... there. Like, I looked at you, and some part of my brain just said... That's Sigma. What do you think this thing is? This bracelet? See, you've got one too. They're pretty much identical. Was on already when I woke up. I haven't figured out what it's for yet, though. No. It's just got a three and the word pair. What are you doing? <laughs> Good luck. I spent a while trying to get mine off while you were napping. It's on pretty tight. Doesn't even have a clasp or anything. I pressed him, but nothing happened. <laughs> Not even a beep. Hey, look! There's something on that screen over there. How are you feeling? I am Zero the Third. <laughs> I'm sure you've got lots of questions. It just seems silly to have a... I'm gonna give you a game to play. Yes, yes, yes. The Nagari Game! Epidex Edition! There's more to it. Lots more. So, hurry up and get out. I forgot to tell you the most important thing. This elevator you're in, it's gonna fall in a few minutes. <laughs> yes, indeed. I'll see you later. Have a nice trick. Oh, I get it. Trip and trick, huh? <laughs> Thank <laughs> you.
I don't want to die here any more than you. Let's go.
Your shoulders? Ugh, I knew it! You sick bastard. Fine. On your knees. You're a little tall for me to just jump up on your shoulders. I'm certainly not going to give you the satisfaction of making me climb. So kneel. <laughs> A little step up is just what I needed. Quiet. You. Me. Go! All right, give me your hand. Well, I'm not Superman, that's for sure. And I'm not Batman or... I'm not a Brahmin or Common or Ramen. My name is Fi. I guess you could say... I am no man. Just come on. One of these days, Witch King. Sure doesn't look like an elevator shaft. Some kind of warehouse, maybe. Yeah. So it would seem. Forget it. Look. More people. Looks like an old guy, a young man, two girls, and... They're all wearing bracelets. Probably safe to assume they're trapped here, too. No, we don't. I haven't been out here much longer than you. They grabbed you too, huh? I think we all shared that particular experience. The smoke seems to be some kind of general anesthetic. No! Mr. Dio and I were in the same elevator, but... That would be me. This little guy here is Quark. Nice to meet you, mister. Tenmi OG Alice and Luna all woke up in different elevators. Correct me if I'm wrong. No, you've got it right. Yep. Me. She's Luna. Hello. It's very nice to meet you. And you are? Say that again. Bastard. Um, are you two... You think? your bracelet there. Hmm. And yours. Fi, right? Now let me have a look. Uh, I thought so. 
Quark, you and Dio show them your bracelets. Oh, sharp eye there. Hmm. Show them yours too, ladies. Right. You figure it out then? Sigma and I are the red pair. Dio and Quark are the blue pair. Each pair got but Tenmyoji, Alice, and Luna were all solos. So... Hmm. Don't got the foggiest idea. I don't know why we're split up like this either. Does anybody know what the three means? Maybe it has something to do with the game. Yes, yes, yes! The Nagami game! And the gifts are... Yes, in the elevator. He said something about the elevator falling. think we'd have done it last if there was? <laughs> well, give it a shot, why don't you? <laughs> I don't think you'll be able to force that door with anything short of a tank. I told you already. <sighs> Each one's got a digital lock on it. We can't pick the lock, and we can't break down the door. Why would I lie? No, unfortunately. Not that we've found, anyway. Well, there is one thing I'm a little curious about. I was the first to escape. That means I know who was in which elevator. I watched all of you come out, after all. Well... I was in the one-third from the right. Tenmyoji was the second out. Your elevator was second from the left, I think. Mm, good memory. Yeah. Third was Luna. You climbed out of the rightmost elevator, didn't you? Yes, that's the one. Dio and Quark were next. You came out of the elevator next to Luna's, right? Yeah, we did. And finally, the two of you were trapped in... The third elevator from the left. <laughs> Yes. No one has come out of the leftmost elevator. Are you... are you saying there's still someone in there? I can't say for certain, but it does seem strange. Maybe we should go take a look. Some kind of card reader? Maybe it unlocks it or something. There's one next to each door. What do you think Ambidex room is supposed to mean? Well, it says it on all six of the elevators. Maybe it has something to do with the game that Zero was talking about. Oh, the Nonary game. <laughs> So they've taken everything we were carrying? Wonderful. Maybe there's no one in there. What makes you so sure? What's that? Look! It's opening! There was someone in there! Clover! Are you okay? Clover! Wake up! What did you do to her? Nothing. She was like that when I woke up. I really wouldn't worry, though. 
She should be all right. Her breathing is steady. I believe she's only sleeping. Then she hasn't woken up since they kidnapped her. Uh, kidnapped? Begging your pardon, but I'm afraid I don't understand what you mean. Where are we? And who are you? <laughs> I'm... Hmm... Who am I? I don't remember. I don't remember anything. I have no idea where I am, or who I am, or what day it is. If you happen to know any of those things, I would very much appreciate it if you share that information. Not knowing one's identity is... vexing. Oh yeah, very original. The amnesiac routine. How are we supposed to take you seriously when you're wearing this... this... this robot suit? We can't even see your face! Are you gonna tell us someone forced you into that thing? I assume so. It seems the most reasonable explanation. When I woke up, I was wearing this... armor. You look pretty calm for a man who doesn't know who he is. Look? That's an odd choice of words. I'm wearing a mask. How would you know how I... look? You know what I meant, you smartass. Uh... Oh. She's waking up. Clover! Are you okay? Come on, talk to me! Is where are we? What? No, no, that can't. When did you lose your memory? When? That's a difficult question. I suppose... when I was born. I think he has generalized amnesia. It's a type of memory loss. People affected by it retain knowledge like... But anything that has to do with... Um, themselves is just... lost. It's a very serious condition. Most research suggests that it's mainly psychological, not... <laughs> hmm... Maybe I had a really bad breakup? <laughs> Bullshit. This guy's obviously full of it. Don't tell me you're actually buying this. supposed to mean I think it's somebody's way of saying hello you heard me it's an anagram yeah they tried a lot of names before they worked it down to Tella come on seriously you've never heard of an anagram it's a kind of exact watch Seems like somebody was expecting us, doesn't it? True, but you're assuming that Zero isn't one of us. <laughs> huh? 
Huh? Look. Over there. Shame on you, Fido. You can't say what I'm about to say before I say it. I've got a plan, you know. I can't just tell you everything at once. Although, things are starting to get exciting. <laughs> Where are you, you little bastard? Too scared to come out and face me like a man? Are you an idiot? I'm a rabbit. You really think a talking rabbit is a real thing? Of course I don't. You're some kind of CG rabbit or something, probably. That's not what I meant, though. Oh! You meant you want to see the person who's controlling me? Yes, God, touch this one a little too hard. What? Weren't you listening to Fido? She's clever, you know. <laughs> Well, yes. I guess that's one way to put it. Are you really sure? You're responding to our questions and stuff right now. That means you're not just, like, a, a video somebody made. Wouldn't that mean that Zero would have to be controlling you and sending you answers right now? Because it doesn't look like anyone's doing that. Well, of course they aren't. I'm an AI. <laughs> Artificial intelligence powered by a quantum computer. Zero is the one who built me, of course. So I guess that makes one of you my parent. Now, are you a mommy or a daddy? <laughs> that would be telling. <laughs> now, with that said, I guess I should probably tell you that I'm not the one who brought you here. I mean, obviously, I don't even have a body. I'm just the facilitator. I just do what I'm told to do. And what do you facilitate? Didn't I say? The game, of course! <laughs> Correct! It's my job to make sure it runs smooth. No, it's supposed to be over. So, what is the Nona game? Nonary refers to a base nine. Nona can therefore it stands Thanks, nine is a very, very important number in this game. After all, nine is your goal. Goal? Yes, goal. You see that door in front of you. That's your door. If you can open the door with an eye on it, you can escape. What do we have to do to open it? Yes, yes, yes. Let me explain. Look at your left wrists. You see the bracelet? Of course you do. Now, tell me, Fido, what number is on yours? A three. What about the rest of you? They're all the same. We've all got threes. Exactly. I'm going to call those numbers bracelet points. Only the people who can get their number to nine or more will be able to open the door with a nine on it and escape. See the box on the wall? That's how you'll get out. Anyone with a greater than or equal to 9 dp can pull that lever and the door will open. However... There are three rules you can't forget. One, the number 9 door will only stay open for 9 seconds. When your time is up, it will close automatically, so be careful. Number nine door only opens once! Once that happens, it's all over! Three! Now, maybe some of you are thinking, you're thinking, oh ho, if my BP is too low, then I'll just have someone with enough BP open the door, and I'll just slip through when it's open. But that's not gonna happen! If you think you can be sneaky, well... <laughs> oh, I... I shouldn't say that yet. <laughs> All you need to know is that anybody who tries to sneak out gets hit with a big penalty. <laughs> what the hell does that mean? Down in front! I'll tell you later. Um... Yeah... Why did you start making... rabbit puns? Uh... Well, um... <laughs> Cause I felt like it. I thought it might make me sound cute. Never mind that. You still haven't told us what we need to know most. How do we get BP? Oh, that's easy. Just use the Abidex room. If you like abbreviations, you can always call it the AB room instead. You mean those... uh... elevators? Gold Star! 
So how do we go about... How else do you use a room? You go in. No, I had a hunch you might try that. So I closed those up tight while you were talking. So don't be hatching any hatch plans, you understand? I live in the master computer. That means all the electronic doors in this cool warren are under my control. How do we get in then? We tried the doors on the front, they're all locked. There's a card reader next to each one, isn't there? All you gotta do is slide a card through, and there you go. But where do we find those key cards? Well, we don't got them. There weren't any in the warehouse. Uh, oh, well, no. Of course there wouldn't be any there. Then where are they? I think you'll find what you're looking for behind the chromatic door. <laughs> Hold on, I thought those doors were locked. Work. What? You see those buttons on the sides of your watch. Can you press them at the same time? Why? To make little boys ask questions. Just press them, please. In fact, why do... <laughs> the two digits on the left show hours, and the two on the right show minutes. Does that mean it's 12.10 in the morning? No. Numbers are going down. It's going from 10 minutes to 9. So... That would mean this must be counting down to something, right? Correct. I don't even need to explain the rest, do I? I'm guessing this is the time until the chromatic doors unlock. Ding, 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 ding! Very important! Uh. Just like the number nine door, they won't stay open. You have five minutes. Once your time is up, the doors will close no matter what. That's just the primary door. What? Each door in this warren has a twin. Isn't that nice? The chromatic doors aren't any different. There's one door on this side, one door on the other side. Unfortunately, the secondary chromatic door on the other side is locked too. Couldn't make it easy for us, could you? Of course you'll all have to split up. Split up? Yep. Cleaver, can you tell him? Why are you asking me? Because you're the only person who hasn't talked to me. I try to communicate with as many people as I can. It helps me improve, you see. I'm trying to get into the rabbit of doing it all the time. Now, answer my questions. Do you know? Well... Y you're supposed to be able to make it so... Red. How? Green. What if... Blue. That's right! Now, take another look. Notice how... Yeah, we get it. The red and blue... Green and... And I miss it. Wonder I they're in... You're talking about what happens if you... Yep. What do you... If you want to open a door, but all you've got is one color, then you can use that to open a door with the complementary color to the one you've got. Hmm. I see. So if you've got red and red, then you can open the cyan door. Blue and blue can open the yellow door. And green and green can open the magenta door. Right again! Looks like your brain hasn't rotted away yet, Ten Mioli. Uh, just what the hell's that supposed to mean? It means exactly what it's I was trying to compliment you. Oh well, let's continue, shall we? There are two types of bracelets. Pair that means there's two types of players, too, in this game. The two members of a pair are considered to be a single entity. Well, isn't that a good deal? I mean, you get two for the price of one! Unfortunately, that also means they can't split up. Both members of a pair have to go through the same chromatic door. Solos don't have any restrictions like that, though. I mean, why would they? They're forever alone. But that means that they can go wherever they want. Now, let's take a new look Bracelets. We'll start with you. What color is <laughs> Are you up? Find a metallic. It's just... What? It's red. Yo. Blue. Am yeah, I... Moody. I'm a blue... I'm... Green Solo. And... Uh... I'm... Uh... Let's see. I suppose you can call me... K. 
I knew it. You were just lying about that amnesia crap. I'm not lying. This was just a... How do I put it? A flash of insight, I suppose. I saw the letter K. So? What does K have to do with anything? I wish I knew. Sadly, I have no idea. Does it mean anything to you? Asshole. Come on now, boy. Now, uh... Can I call you? Yes. I'm guessing your bracelet is the same as Clover's. That's right. It says, and the text is... <laughs> or you could work with Mr. Dio and me. We're blue too. Whoops! Oh, you have to have exactly three people. That means you can't have two people, or four people, or well, pretty much. And I guess I should probably tell you that the secondary door won't open until the primary door closes. It's made that way to keep out cheaters. We didn't want a fourth or fifth person just running in at the last minute like, No, wait for me! When the right people open the door. But if the primary door closes first, then that's impossible! You see? It all makes sense. And you might have run a hair too long in my explanation. Any questions? 